गुड मॉर्निंग टू डेयर स्टूडेंट्स टूडेज टॉपिक इज चैनलाइजेशन चैनलाइजेशन इज अ मल्टीपल एक्सेस मैथड इन विच द अवेलेबल बैंडविथ ऑफ अ लिंक इज शेयर इन टाइम फ्रिक्वेंसी और थ्रू कोड बिटवीन डिफरेंट स्टेशन इन दिस सेक्शन वी विल डिस्कस थ्री चैनलाइजेशन प्रोटोकॉल्स एफ डी में फ्रिक्वेंसी डिवीजन मल्टीपल एक्सेस टी डी एम में टाइम डिवीजन मल्टीपल एक्सेस एंड सी डी एम में कोड डिवीजन मल्टीपल एक्सेस सो वन बाय वन वी विल डिस्कस ऑल थ्री ऑफ दिस मल्टीपल एक्सेस टेक्निक्स द फर्स्ट वन इज फ्रिक्वेंसी डिवीजन मल्टीपल एक्सेस विच इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एफ डी एम ए इन फ्रिक्वेंसी डिवीजन मल्टीपल एक्सेस द अवेलेबल बैंड विथ इज डिवाइडेड इन टू फ्रिक्वेंसी बैंड्स ईच स्टेशन इज अलोकेटेड अ बैंड टू सेंड इट्स डाटा इन अदर वर्ड्स ईच बैंड इज रिजर्व फॉर अ स्पेसिफिक स्टेशन एंड इट बिलोंग्स टू अ स्टेशन ऑल द टाइम ईच स्टेशन ऑल्सो यूज अ बैंड पास फिल्टर टू कन्फाइन द ट्रांसमीटर फ्रिक्वेंसीज to prevent station interferences the allocated bands are separated from one another by small guard bands this figure shows the idea of fdma in fdma the available bandwidth of the common channel is divided into bands that are separated by guard bands the second technique is tdma time division multiple access in time division multiple access the station share the bandwidth of the channel in time in each station is allocated a time slot during which it can send data each station transmits its data in a single assigned time, time slot figure shows the idea behind the tdm the main problem with tdm lies in achieving synchronization between the different stations each station needs to know the beginning of its slot and the location of its slot this may be difficult because of propagation delay introduced in the system if the stations are separated over a large area to compensate for the delays we can insert guard times synchronization is normally accomplished by having some synchronization bits normally referred to as preamble bits at the beginning of each slot so in tdm the bandwidth is just one channel that is time shared between different stations the third technique is cdma time core division multiple access core division multiple access was conceived several decade ago recent advances in electronic technology have finally made its implementation possible cdma differs from fdma because only one channel occupies the entire bandwidth of the link it differs from tdma because all stations can send data simultaneously there is no time share in cdma one channel carry carries or transmissions simultaneously there is an analogy let us first give an analogy about cdma cdma simply means communication with different codes for example in a large room with many pupils two people can only talk in english but nobody else understand english another two people can talk in chinese if they are the only ones who understand chinese and so on in other words the common channel the space of the room in this case can easily allow communication between several couples but in different languages codes so 
this is all about the cdma now we will finished the topic channelization here thank you